what will be the honest confession of your person if they were like in front of you and let us see let us talk to their higher self what comes from their higher self to you okay but uh, remember it is a collective reading and take what resonates leave what doesn't it might not resonate with everybody and if you want to book a paid private reading it will be you can email me at divine mother's guidance at gmail.com and i have only one account in tiktok divine mother's guidance um with 129k plus followers and only one account in instagram divine mother's guidance with 3800 plus followers only one youtube channel let's us tarot please subscribe to my channel thank you so much so let us see what will they say the first card i fear you moved on from me due to some reason this person is feeling like that you are no longer available i believe you have pulled your energy that is causing this person to feel like that okay you 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 have moved on which is good which is good keep moving on i believe we are meant to be together so even though they fear that you are moving on somewhere but they believe that strongly that this connection is meant to be you guys are meant to be together no matter whatever is going on right now you will be together again i wish i can have another chance with you that's really good they want another chance with you i hate who i really am from you okay with other cards supporting here it's telling me that this person might not have shown you how much they truly love you they might have shown ah i don't care you are whatever go move whatever i don't care i don't need your love but this is not true this person truly loves you this person truly wants to be with you but they did not show you that that how much you mean to their life i love you very beautiful very beautiful this person loves you i think you are dealing with avoidant uh two hearts together so i think this person believes that you are this card card is gives me the vibe of the soulmate card so this person believes that you are their soulmate i think they are realizing once you walked away from them you pulled your energy back this person is realizing that you are their soulmate they want to be with you forever this is beautiful okay we are healing and learning so that's why i that's the point i say the soulmate or divine counterpart whichever way you take it when you are each other divine counterpart when this this separation happens this actually a god's or divine's way of separating you two so that you can heal together and learn together and this is what happening whoever this relationship is for whatever this this reading is for this is beautiful and i believe you know that this separation is making giving you an opportunity to to be the best version of yourself so that you can work on the insecurities all the triggers you have so when they come back together you can learn and grow and be a you know healthier relationship and a stronger relationship they blank it means sometimes they don't know what to say they love you this person loves you okay two more cards i'm still haunted by my actions so whatever they did two more okay this is the one another one whatever they did they are really really feeling like they did a big big mistake and they are blaming themselves for that and now they are blaming themselves for you moving on they want you back so beautiful i am afraid that it is too late for to make it right they are saying it twice so it is too late so i believe this person is you are dealing with a person who was typically avoided but now they are feeling very anxious this person when where with you didn't value you they were thinking like i don't need you and things like that and they pushed you away and now when you walked away from this connection you pulled your energy back that's like the moving on energy this person is started to freak out and they are realizing how much you mean to their life and how much they are missing you and that is actually making this person to feel like come forward and now they are haunted by their action but they don't know whether you going to take them or not this is beautiful if this is really your reading that's that's really really good but you never know if this is your reading or not don't jump like a monkey okay up and down you keep doing your fucking life this is a collective reading it can be some it maybe we are very it's of too wishful thinking for you that it is my person who really knows because it is a collective reading right but again if you feel connected you know this is your person then it can be your reading whatever shit it is i don't care all i care is like you being happy and that is only possible when you focus on yourself you love yourself you focus on your business your job healthy eating exercise putting your self pedestal saying that i am who i am and that is enough never saying anything negative self talk you know speaking like i am though i am maybe the i am the problem maybe i am the these and that stop those things love yourself put yourself on pedestal they are not the prize you are the prize remember that because in today's world 
people can earn money people can get success in you know career and all but getting a person who truly loves them it's a really really blessing and a prize if they got you somebody like you who are watching a tarot reading wasting their time just because you are feeling distress for that person it speaks a lot that how much you love them and that's a blessing in their life that love works like a protection that work love works like a motivation in this their life so you are the prize remember that so if they treated you wrong it is their part to rectify that and come back to you but meanwhile you focus on yourself put your boundaries up and love yourself okay you take care sweetheart bye